there with Dylan Fournier. Scores scores uh, his team's goal. Uh, I, I, you were you're the last defenseman added to the game, uh, getting you know getting in after you know Cody Cece had had the, his back. How'd you feel overall, just to be able to, to you know what, but well, how you did tonight and and to be able to score a goal? I thought it all right. The goal was great. You know that was uh, a bit of a cherry on top of the night, and uh, you know I was heading to the net. Guy made a great move, put it on net, and just I hit it home and went right in. Yeah. So just overall, what, what do you say about the experience? I mean, this is oh, uh, just great. You know, you know some of these guys over here, they're unbelievable hockey players, and every a lot of these guys are going to have great careers in hockey, and just uh, it was fantastic to play with some of them. Yeah. Well, you, you remember, it was pretty. Uh, and it was. I mean, it was a, a one-shot game the whole way. I mean, how exciting is it to play him? In, in, a, in a contest like that. Oh, you know, I, I hear some of these games, like last year, I think the score was up a little bit, and the guys 7 were 7-2, yeah. Yeah, and, uh, you know, this one was tight right down to the guys were hitting, guys were fighting, guys were guys were playing playing to win, and there was a lot of a lot of competition out there and a lot of comp competitiveness. It was, it was, it was, yeah. it was great, great to see. Yeah, so how much do you think this is going to help you going back to uh, Rouen for the rest of the year, you know, help, well, trying I, to help I, your team get some playoff games under their belt this yeah, season? Yeah, yeah, I was um, hoping for that going back. You know, we got to get some wins over there. And, uh, it's just, you know, it was a hell of an experience and something that you can only build off of, I think.